people, 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 people. Que pasa, sapa, say what they do. Now, people, it seems like St. Elizabeth is no longer labeled as the breadbasket capital of Jamaica. People, it is now called the hothead them I send people in a casket. And people, I am speaking specifically about an incident that took place on Thursday night in the wee hours of the morning. We are speaking about an incident in which the Pope are now investigating a double slap away in a place called Good Hope. And it is said that the two deceased are known as 53-year-old Evan Robinson and also 40-year-old Gilmore Castillo. Now, based on the information from the residents, it is said that in the wee hours of the morning, they heard all sorts of loud explosion. We are talking about those infamous pie pie sound. And when they called the Pope and went to investigate after the smoke cleared, they found two men we are speaking about with their bodies riddled. We are talking about multiple, we are talking about carnal. Now, based on the information, it is said that these two men are also from good hopes of people. We are speaking about a community in which persons are not used to any sort of crime and violence. Whilst we are talking about two people one time, we are speaking about back to back. Now, people, based on the information from the residents, it is said that none of these two persons are known or none of their family members is linked up or known or associated or affiliated with no sort of, we are speaking about gang membership or any sort of crime. Now, based on the information from the Popo, it is said that a set of Popo impersonator. Some men dress up like them are Popo, but they were actually, we are talking about some shutters. They ordered the two men out the house and kind of put them upon them knee and basically blaze them up. We are speaking about multiple times. I am speaking about each man get X amount of rounds. So people, this is obviously some sort of hit. This is no type of, we are speaking about mistaken identity because people, the truth and the facts that if you get X amount of shot, that means that they came directly for you. And people, like I said before, the residents say that they are stunned, they are basically trembling, they are worrying, they are wondering, they are pondering what is going on because none of these two persons are known as any sort of crime. We are speaking about producers. They are known as peaceful persons in the community. Now, people, when we list the stuff like this on a regular basis, we have to understand that good people get caught up with all sorts of things and people, I am not saying that that is the case in this case. However, a lot of times good persons, because of economic reason, them basically get themselves mixed up with some bad people and people, whenever anything basically hit the fan, it is always the good persons that are getting taken out before or the first person to get taken out. The bad people, them always know if they take for themselves. However, because the good persons not really familiar with the crime situation or how to handle themselves. They are always the victims, point blank and period. And the next thing that we have to also take into consideration, if them can't catch quark out, they are going to catch them shot. So people, me don't know if any of these two persons, family member mix up in a, any sort of rete, lele, blue, blah, bling. However, people, whenever you see anything happen like this, there is always something into something. And people like them say, wherever there is smoke, there is fire. Because people, I don't think that these two persons were basically taken out like that in such a fashion without anything being link to it so therefore me just as say something in a something and people we have to also remember that St. Elizabeth is a farming community we are speaking about people raise all sort of sheep and goat and cow and we know that Prairie last year it is basically big in a them place so people I don't know what it has to do with however I know that there is some sort of problem and people this problem came back and haunt these persons in the worstest way point blank and period so people, the moral of the story is that any type of card can play and there could be any sort of scenario. Nobody knows until the Pope basically do them investigation and get to the bottom of this. So people, anything can be into anything. Point blank and period. So anyways people, that is my views on the whole thing as it pertains to that. And like me say, it is just my views and opinion. It is not the gospel. Your views and opinion can be respectfully different from mine. But let me know what you think in the comment section. Bless up. 
Now, before I move to the next part of my video, please subscribe to my next channel. It is called Jamaica Dancehall Source, and I'll be pinning the link to that channel in the description of this video. And also, please subscribe to this channel through Jamaica Buzz. And when you subscribe, please press the notification bell or icon, and also press all in the option. Now, people, the next thing that is popping in the news, I don't know if it is because of the Big C situation. I don't know if it is because of poverty. And we are speaking about persons are broke. But one thing that I do know is that Jamaicans are a set of hostile and very barbaric people. So I just as I said, people seem to kick off for the simplest of things. No matter how petty it is, it seems as if they always resort to violence. So people, I am speaking about an incident that took place the other day. And people, I don't know exactly where it was. However, two men kind of kick off and all sorts of sharp object draw and rate and lele. And people, what is even more disturbing is the fact that even when a plain clothes popo intervene and bust up to a can of the ear for basically calm it down, people, them still kick off like to P I T B U L L S. So, people, take a listen, take a look to the edited version of this video, and you understand that this is YouTube, Rete, Lele, Blue, Blah, Blah. However, if you want this video, you can WhatsApp me 1 876 894. 2711 but be very patient and just give your name and just say video Jesus Christ find by someone boy and find by someone take it nine take it nine Jesus Christ and shot fire eh? somebody with lights on fire um. Jesus Christ <laughs> Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Now, people, like I said before, Jamaicans are a set of angry person. They are a set of animal. Them act like some wild animal more time. People, I don't even understand it. It is as if they are so frustrated with life and people like them say, Misery loves company and whenever you have a set of persons that are unemployed, the devil always finds some sort of work for idlers. And people, I think that in this case, that is the case. And people, based on the video evidence, you hear them calling out one of the name of one of the person. I think his name is Fine Voice. And um, people, you know, say, if somebody gets stabbed or somebody loses them life, somebody is going to the big yard, point blank and period. However, these persons don't care. It is all about the hype. It is all about entertainment. It is all about that image. And um, people like them say in a Jamaica, image is everything. Everybody wants that bad man credibility. It does not matter if it send them to the big yard or the cemetery point blank and period so anyways people that is my views on the whole thing as it pertains to that and like me say it is just my views and opinion it is not the gospel your views and opinion can be respectfully different from mine but let me know what you think in the comment section bless up